Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hi guys, now you are watching Monarok Podcast Nuri Channel With me, Nur Syamilah Bahia Audio Jungle. How's life guys? I hope you are all in a good condition I would like to talk about how we as millennial generation Preserve the authentic Indonesian culture in the midst of great cultural development for better Indonesia So, let me start from explaining what actually Millennial Era is. The Millennial Era is marked by the ease in which people get information from various parts of the world as a result of rapid technological development. Who belongs to Millennial Era generation? Mentioned in many researches. Millennial generation are those who was born between 1980s to 2000s. I'm sure most of us who watch this video belong to the millennials. Millennial generation is the generation who is very proficient in technology. With their capabilities in the world of technology and facilities, this generation has many opportunities to be far ahead of the previous generation. In the midst of all advance of technology, this condition not only contributes positively to the nation, but at the same time gives negative impacts. Millennial generation tend to be individual, neglecting political value, focusing on materialistic value, and less care to help others. Talking about culture, there is no doubt that Indonesia is a nation rich in culture. Hundreds or maybe thousands, both in the form of objects and intangible cultures. You know what? Puppet, batik, keris, dances, for example, saman, traditional musical instruments like gamelan, historic buildings, folk songs, and so on are invaluable cultural heritage. In these days, Where technological progress has been so rapid, we should not neglect this historical relics because the contents of the novel values of the Indonesian people are stored in each of these works. The advancement of internet technology with its ability to penetrate geographical boundaries, as if the world is not distant, is not a barrier to continue preserving our old cultures. This is our common challenge. So, if we neglect our own cultures, it will be the same as uprooting the roots of Indonesian culture which will trap us into foreign cultural livoria with no clear direction. Do you want to do that? No, I don't want to do that. There are my small notes for millennial generation to preserve the authentic Indonesian culture in the midst of the rampant information technology that spread across a variety of lifestyle and foreign cultures. First point, we can use technological advances to creatively package the original Indonesian culture to be introduced internationally. Second point, loving authentic Indonesian culture is not an ancient and outdated thing. Instead, it will be positive if it can show creativity and introduce to the world. The number of foreigners who learn about Indonesian culture has proven that Indonesian culture has a high value and deserves to be learned and even must be preserved. Millennial generation must be able to maintain the original Indonesian culture because this is our identity that given by the ancestor of Indonesian. It is not about speaking in language, but it is about speaking in culture. Well, be proud Indonesian! That's all from me. Thank you so much for the great attention. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe our YouTube channel. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Audio jump.